A vacation ending in tragedy. A little girl tumbles two stories on a Carnival cruise ship. Now investigators want to know what led up to this fatal fall. The accident happened this morning after the ship docked at Port Miami. Other passengers tried to help, but it was too late. Local 10 News reporter Derek Shore is in Miami with the latest. Well, such an incredibly sad way to end a vacation. Losing a child, we're told that eight year old fell nearly two dozen feet down inside this cruise ship. She was rushed here to ride her trauma center, but she would die from her injuries. It was a frantic, tragic end to a fun filled cruise to the Caribbean. Passengers and crew members on the carnival ship Glory rushing to help an eight year old girl who tumbled two stories down from a landing in the ship's atrium. Just everybody was devastated. You couldn't believe it happened. Everybody crying. Bob Dorr, one of the ship's passengers and former first responder, can be seen trying to help the little girl. I just heard a loud noise and a lot of screaming. And I kind of knew what happened. I'm a retired EMT. I went running down and I checked for pulses. She had no pulses. I did CPR as long as until the, the doctor showed up. Once the doctor showed up, she took over. The child is said to have landed between a chair and a table on the hard ground, according to other passengers. And if she had landed on the couch, she probably would have had a chance. But she didn't. I'm not sure exactly what happened, how the child fell, but we understand that the child may have fallen uh, about 20 or so feet. From a landing. The incident happening right as the ship was coming back from seven days at sea, just docking in Port Miami. The little girl rushed to ride her trauma, but would later be pronounced dead. Miami-Dade police now investigating just how this could happen. My heart goes out to the family. Put the family in your prayers, please. Everybody put the family in their prayers. And tonight, Carnival Cruise Lines also offering their support, saying their thoughts are with the family during this time. The family did not want to comment here at the hospital, and that child's name has not yet been released. In Miami, Derek Shore, Local 10 News.